Hi right, guys, uh, on today's video, we're looking at VEX 50 index on the daily chart. And we have this high point of value around this point here, of which the market has been tapping like the same area for the longest. We have this touch, second touch, and third touch at the top of the structure. And then on this one, initially we took a trade around this area here uh, for a sell, but I'll show you like the sell setup that we took. So we have this ascending channel around this point. This ascending channel around this point. And then I'm catering like for the touches, most touches. I'm catering for most touches here. Even if I don't get like some of them, it's okay. So we have this ascending channel around this point. And then we have this 90% of which the market has already tapped. And then as you all know, the 90% rule is the area whereby you get like some type of a larger flag most of the time it's the red zone and then we have this high point of value and then we also have this one around this area here so we are currently in this area and then we had some type of an ascending channel on the lower time frame of which you'll see when we switch to the lower time frame and then we have this high point and then initially for this trade we are targeting like the lows around this area here this is where we are targeting the overall target just because this would be like a high probability setup whereby you get a clear double bottom around this point here and then that would be a nice trade for you to take just because this uh low here holds more value unlike this one here at the top of the structure so that is why we are continuing with the selling opportunities and then as you can see we had this large impulse corrective move impulse corrective move impulse corrective move impulse corrective move impulse so this is the larger corrective move to initially push to the downside complete the overall uh price action that we are looking forward to seeing so i hope you're enjoying the videos that i share so far guys and then you can appreciate like the, all the work that i put in by clicking the like button by subscribing by sharing and all of the, those good stuff guys so we are in this area here now so i'm trying to regenerate the setup that i shared with my vip group and of which to join the vip group guys as i said it's 150 dollars of which in sa rents it's one point is 2.6 guys and then it's a once of payment whereby you get all the things that you need like in the markets so we have this ascending channel so i'm trying to uh regenerate the setup that i shared in the vip group so we have the ascending channel and then we have the 90 percent we had this as our first target, this as our second target for a short-term entry. And then I can just push this, uh, make it nice around this point. And then on the, oh, let me just cater for this area here. As I said, you must make this uh, drawing patterns a habit so that you can understand how they operate. So this is a clear pattern that I'm seeing. Just to train your eyes when you're in the markets, you can just do this exercise whereby you draw out like each and every structure that is clear to you or that is visible to you, just like this. So I've drawn each and everything that is obvious to me. And then also this one was a previous entry. I don't know if I shared the setup or not but it was a previous entry whereby we were targeting this area here so let's switch to the hour chart so on the hour that is where we took like the entry so on the hour we had like a pattern within a pattern of which it's a high probability setup for us if we get like this that type of formation whereby we get a pattern within a pattern just like this so we had like uh, an ascending channel within an ascending channel. And then we had a clear push to the downside of which is this one here. I'll just remove the ray line. We had this push to the downside. And then we came back to retest this area here of which you can see it as an OB or an other block. It's okay, but I think uh, on this uh, type of setup, I'm seeing it as a double top formation, as you can see here. And then we took the entry I think it was an early entry. We didn't wait for the one hour can close and then we just took the entry just around this point and then our stop loss is just above this area. We are targeting this area for 3.9. The overall target is at around 7.5% for the overall uh, trade. 
and then yeah uh let me just check if i'm leaving anything out so let's switch to the 15 minute 15 minute time frame let's see the 15 minute time frame just to make sure that uh everything is still intact so as you can see on the 15 minute time frame that is where you'll see like each and everything very clearly this is the top of the structure where we took this nice setup and then this is where uh, the setup is currently at and then i'll share a screenshot so that you can see that i shared the setup so for now we are just uh, sitting on our hands we're just waiting up until this trade forms up very nicely up until we reach the first target or up until we break structure that's when we move like our stop loss to break even just because there's no way you can hold like a loss or a some risk in your trade whereby the trade has initially pushed to the downside there is no sense in doing that rather than moving your stop loss to break even and then just holding up until we hit tp or up until we get tagged out in uh, some small profits or large profits depending on how the trade will move so i'll see you on another video uh yeah i'll see you on another video guys